Hi great YouTubers, welcome back. In my previous Visrino video, we controlled a relay using the light dependent resistor. However, there was this rattling noise from the relay anytime we are close to the triggering value. In this video, I will share with you how to resolve this in Visrino using the Schmidt trigger block. Let's get started. Kindly subscribe if you've not done that already and also press on the notification bell. This way you will always be notified whenever I upload new videos. To resolve this rattling issue, we need to introduce some form of hysteresis. I earlier planned resolving this by using a set reset flip-flop where the set input will have a comparator block connected to it with a high triggering value and then the reset will have another with a lower triggering value hence preventing the relay from switching on and off rapidly with slight change in light intensity however Sir Bouyen suggested the use of the Schmidt trigger block which indeed helped to resolve this issue with less effort now let's move on and see how I implemented this in Visuino. Okay, we move into our previous program to implement this. We need to delete the comparator block and this is the value that we set previously. So I double click on it and then select delete selection and now look for the Schmidt trigger block and we need to pick the analog type. So I look for it, drag it onto the canvas connect the output to pin 7 that's where our relay is connected and then drag the analog signal to the input of the block okay we have the block in position now click on it and this is the property we have the threshold value which is set to 0 0.25 and then value 0 0.5 by default okay I go to and then look for my port that my POC is connected and then click on download. Okay, so to set the threshold and then the value correctly, we need to know our max and mean of our sensor. I block it and this is the max value from the sensor. Okay, I release it and then we have the minimum value from the sensor. Okay, with these values in mind, I disconnect and then move to the point where I need to change the values of the threshold and then the value. Note, you need to set the threshold lower than the minimum value recorded from the sensor. So I set it to 0 0.1 and then your value lower than the maximum value recorded from the sensor. Okay, so I set it to 0 0.3. And now let's give it a test. I click on the upload. Uploading is ongoing. Uploading is done. I click on the serial to observe the data coming in. I click on connect. And now we observe. And now block the sensor. And we can see nothing happened. Which means I need to set the threshold a bit lower okay so I move on and change the threshold to 0 0.07 and then click on download once again downloading is done I click on serial we have the interface once again and click on connect now I block it we can see the LED coming on and we can see that the the picking of the LED is solid and no matter how I move my hand, it works perfectly without that rattling noise that we, are, we were having previously. Okay, let's play around a bit. I change the value to 0 0.33 and then click on download again. Downloading done, I click on Syria. And now change to the scope. 
and now let's observe the data on the scoop okay I block it and we can see in the I block it once again it's working perfectly the relay picks and picks very solid without the rattling noise I play around with my hand a bit to see whether I will hear the rattling noise coming back but you can see it's working perfectly I change the value now to 0 0.4 and then download once again to see how it will behave and remember the more closer you get to your max value the less sensitive the system becomes okay I download uploading is done I block it once again and you can see I need to block it very well before the relay energizes I block it once again working perfectly I now change the threshold to 0 0.1 and let's see what happens so we have value of 0 0.4 threshold of 0 0.1 I download uploading done I go to serial and now connect back to the system and then observe the data coming in I block it once again and you can see that I have to block it very well before it comes on it becomes less sensitive but indeed working perfectly without the rattling noise from the relay thank you all for watching please consider giving this video a thumbs up anytime you hit the like button you help us grow this channel see you in the next tutorial bye bye